What's up YouTube? All right, so today I'm going to show you how to make this bass. Um, I called this bass chainsaw truck because it sounded like a mixture of the two. Uh, but here, I'll, I'll get down to business and I'll show you uh, how I made this. So, I used uh, Fruity Loops for this, but you can also use any Ableton Live or Effects Chain plugin to accomplish the same thing that I did. And it's pretty easy. Uh, all I used was a um, massive, or an instance of massive. And what I did is I hooked it up to macro knobs. So uh, if you want to, you can just pause it here, and then if you pause it, you can copy the settings that I've got on here. Uh, but until then, I'm just going to keep going. Uh, I'll switch to the phase so you can see the phase and the voicing. And the voicing is there. Rooting. Okay. So that should be enough for you guys to um, figure out exactly how I made this bass and try to reproduce it on your own. So I um, attached a drive knob to a hard clipper, a sign shaper and phase because phase gives it a nice little layer of distortion I added width I uh, added macro to a width um, slider here so I can control how wide it gets which gives you really nice effects and mixes when you want to sort of take up space and make the attention of a listener sort of go maybe to the bass or not to the bass whatever you choose and then I also hooked one up to the pitch and I just only made it uh, one octave here um, because I'm boring and I could have done more, but right now this is just a tutorial, so that's why the sound sounds sort of, that's why the sound is by itself. Anyway, so I had to hook those up to uh, macro knobs within Patcher to automate them, so if you want to know how to do that, just ask me in the comments down below. Um, I ran that instance of Massive through a WoW filter and the wow filter is actually where it gets a lot of its uh, character, its vocal character. So I have it um, between an A and an E vowel. Uh, you guys can copy this preset down if you have it. <clears throat> uh, but uh, when I'm playing this I can actually change the vowel characteristic of the song on the fly or of the... <laughs> So that gives it a really nice feeling. Uh, another way you could use this, you don't have to use WoW, uh, Trash 2, Isotope Trash 2 has a really nice vocal setting. Um, let's see, what, what else is there? There's uh, Volcano 2, which is excellent from FabFilter. I recommend you guys get those filter plugins because they are top notch, absolutely top notch. If anybody else knows of any, especially with vocal presets, um, let other people know in the comments down below or let me know because I'd love to try out new plugins. <laughs> Um, I also have the drive way up, so this plugin is where it gets its vocal resonance and the um, overdrive that you hear, that, that grit. Um, but without those, uh, or sorry, without this Vocodex here, everything would sound really, really harsh and, and in your face. So this is all of Vocodex right here. So if you want to pause, you can copy that. Um, <clears throat> the order is down, the wet is up, the drive is up. Uh, if you want to know how I rooted it in, I'm actually modulating the bass sound by itself. So we're not using a voice to modulate the synth sound, we're using the synth to modulate the synth sound. If you want to know how to do that, ask me in the question uh, comments and ask a question down below. Um, I also have the bandwidth multiplier all the way to the left. <clears throat> and if you listen to the difference, not a huge difference. Um, but uh, the settings are where they are and it'll give you this sound so yeah like I said if you want to copy these settings um, by all means do do what you gotta do uh, and past that I put it into an instance of Maximus compression settings will only change your sound a little bit so those are completely to taste uh, if you'd like to copy the settings, I just sort of ran through there. Once again, just press pause real quick. Okay, and so out here, this is my pitch envelope. 
and I didn't use the width envelope or anything like that because like I said this is just a real quick tutorial just showing you guys a, a way to make a base if you want to make if you want me to show you any other ways that I do I'm not professional at it by any means but I do enjoy doing it so uh, we'll have a listen one more time you can see the pitch bend real 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 angry so uh, don't hesitate to ask questions check out my SoundCloud uh, like comment subscribe and I'll see you guys around